What's up guys and welcome back to the channel. Star Wars The Clone Wars Season 7 added a whole lot to the Star Wars universe, changing some things that would echo throughout the universe and things that had been established years prior, in my opinion, many for the better. A lot of which having to do with Order 66 and the fact that the Siege of Mandalore lined up with the events of Revenge of the Sith. Today though, I wanted to talk about something that occurs in the first arc of Star Wars The Clone Wars. In the first arc of The Clone Wars, Anakin steps aside to take a hologram message from Padme Amidala, and later tries to blow it off when his master, Obi-Wan Kenobi, approaches. Obi-Wan, however, reveals that he fully well knew that Anakin was talking with Padme. In an interview later, Dave Filoni actually revealed that Obi-Wan knows a whole lot more than the original film, specifically Revenge of the Sith, let on, but maybe doesn't quite know everything, thus changing a lot of the Star Wars mythos, as before this point, it was never explicitly said how much Obi-Wan really knew about Anakin and Padme's relationship. In the interview, Dave Filoni said this, Obi-Wan is not dumb. He knows that Anakin is in love with that woman. He doesn't think, though, that Anakin took it that far. Getting married, I mean. But even Obi-Wan was in love with someone. That's not abnormal, it's very normal. This is in reference to Obi-Wan Kenobi's relationship with Satine. The real problem with the Jedi and forming these attachments is when these attachments go farther than the Force and the greatness of the Jedi Order in itself. Something that many Jedi in fact disagree with. Jedi such as Qui-Gon Jinn, believing that all life forms and Jedi as a result of that should love one another and should be allowed to love, while Jedi such as Mace Windu and Yoda believed otherwise. This is interesting though, that it comes out and says that yes, Obi-Wan Kenobi was fully aware that there was some sort of a relationship between Anakin and Padme. He just didn't believe that they actually took it as far as to get married. And although it may seem inconsequential, it is pretty earth shattering. It also tells a lot that Obi-Wan Kenobi never relayed this information to the greater Jedi Council, believing that this was a lesson that Anakin had to go through, not realizing that it would ultimately be a major stepping stone to his turn to the dark side of the force. The idea of hiding this relationship from the Jedi and the stresses that it would put on Anakin. Anyway, my friends, what are your guys' thoughts on this and this addition to the Star Wars universe that season seven took? As always, my friends, thank you guys so much for watching. May the force be with you and have a great day.